this is going to be my reaction to the new movie five nights at freddy's what can i say other than let's just check this out right now this whole distorted screen thing is pretty cool But whatever is pursuing him seems to be taking its time. Oh, yeah. I mean, this song is just a bang. Five nights, buddy. This guy is, uh, he's, he's, he's from which movie? He's from which famous movie? The Hunger Games, right? And though the dreamer remains asleep, he walks through memory as if experiencing it for the first time anew. Is stuff for real? Some people think so. Hi. We got this new flavor. Is that, yeah? What's happening there? Rainbow. It's probably just the dad of the kid. It's, oh my goodness, bro overreacted. You beat up a man in broad daylight in front of his child. Yeah, it was probably his dad. Yeah, it was probably his dad. The guy, the guy in the glasses, the guy, is, the guy in the glasses is from Scream One, right? You want the job or not? How's the pay? Not great, but the hours are worse. Notice of delinquency? I've never, I've never seen such a notice. Thanks for babysitting. Come on, please come. No, come in, no. come in. Children. I'm sitting on my friend. My friend says you're an idiot. <laughs> At least I'm real. <laughs> He's reliving memories of himself as a kid. This is like his brother getting kidnapped. So that's why he reacted like that in the, back in back when he saw that dude. Garrett! In your heart, you know that this is the right thing to do. I hope oh. that you will sign. We'll see to it that you never see your sister again. Is that what you want? That's harsh. Hello. Uh, hi, Mr. Raglan. This is Mike. Mr. I can't work nights. <laughs> Mr. I can't work nights. You've changed your mind? The job that you offered was, uh, was still available. Oh, it absolutely is. So, we're in the opening sequence, were we watching like the, the previous security guard getting killed or something? That's what we were seeing, right? In the opening of the movie. Has his name? State-of-the-art robotic engineering enables our characters to interact with guests in truly lifelike fashion. Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria is here to delight, dazzle, and entertain for years to come. Oh boy. That was not scary. It's only because of the sound effect they put that it seems scary. Hello? Are there no lights here? I can see neon lights, so why not just like switch on the main switch or something? <laughs> Man, he's sleeping on the job. The fuck? Did you see who took my brother? Great. Wait! No! Hey, by the way, I, I do intend on, on paying you. Eventually. My goodness, bro. Okay. Welcome to Sparky's. Could I set you folks up with some appetizers? You do realize that lunch is the most important meal. Oh, it's the dude. It's the dude, the, the dude from YouTube. Matt something. That dude. Huh? The, the YouTuber. The film theory guy. You know him. 
You told me what a nice kid my niece is and that my nephew sleeps a lot. He really does, though. Sleep? Wait, this chick is snitching. Why don't we just kill him? Jeez. Tempting. Security guard, right? His job is to make sure nobody gets in. So, we get in. Jeez, sinister as fuck. Talented actor, but I feel like they do nothing with this character other than sleeping, sister trouble, and reliving dreams. Wait, please, please don't, don't, don't run. Okay, I, I just want to know what you saw. Jeez. Who? Certain thing maybe fell asleep on the job. Because he does all the time. Can I uh, help you, officer? Oh. Nasty. He was cut in the dream, and then now it has happened in real life. I'm a certified EMT. So if your heart ever goes out, I'm the one you want to call. How can I call you when my heart has gone out to the? What? Did that chick just offer him a dance? Why the hell does that grow one robot have a hook hand? If you know, comment below and smash like and subscribe if you haven't yet. Get the guys and meet me here. I think I see a way in. But here's the question. If main character guy is guarding the place at night, why would he then be fired because it was vandalized in the morning? Not oh boy. What are we looking at? Holy lord, it has eyes. Oh boy. This is bringing back memories of Alien. Alien, which I've read it to on this channel. Don't leave it to pop up here at the end screen. Come on. That's really nice. Come on. <laughs> Come Listen to it, you can hear it moving. Do, 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 do. Hey. Oh shit. What is this thing? Is it like Pac-Man? It goes nom 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 nom. Oh, this is great. Who's that boy? Hey, wait! Come on! I know typically in like horror movies I'd be like, don't follow the scary little kid, but in this case, I mean, you'd be like, why is this kid here in this place that we are robbing? Hmm? Is he inside the thing? Oh my good lord. I expected her to be sucked in, not chomped in half. Made a mess. Sorry. Mike didn't tell me he had a daughter. Gross. No, well, my sister. Gross. Well, he didn't tell me he had a sister either. Newsflash, if you're too whacked out to remember to lock a friggin' door, accident or not, you're liable. So every night I dream, and I go back to that same memory, and I, I search for details for any little thing that got overlooked. I thought the first time he looked at the person who was kidnapping his brother, the person was driving away. So he only saw like the back of his head or something. Yeah. And that's usually the part where people tell me I'm crazy. No more sleeping on the job. When you're at Freddy's, you stay alert. Do you understand? I understand. This is not a vacation, okay? You're not here to have fun. Okay. Oh, she actually went to sleep. She didn't go to play play with things. You can't use the same jump scare twice and expect it to work, motherfucking movie. Oh no. Show you. 
No, they are willing to talk. What will you give us? Anything. Oh. Mike. <laughs> ah. They wouldn't stop tickling me. I thought she was being was like. Die. I thought she was having like her leg beaten or something. Everyone, this is Mike. Oh, she's hugging a terrifying monster that kills people. The look on his face is like, hey, what the fuck was that? Let me guess. No. What? She's been drawing. Are they... Ghosts? Yeah. Of course. You, you drew that, right? Oh yeah, it's the brother getting kidnapped. Who told you about that? Was it a, a boy with blonde hair? I can ask. I would really appreciate that. So is she like clairvoyant or something? You knew about this? Yeah, probably. Guess you figured it out. I think we could use the tables for the fort. Everyone? Follow me. What just okay? happened? If you told me I'd be watching a movie where mechanical robots make a fort for a child, I'd be like, you're joking, man. 2023 can't be that weird. Sounds like we need a roof. I'll go see what I can find. They do like Abby. Mike, you need to drop this. She knows a lot. Wait, Abby, don't! What? Oh, boy. You just had an accident. You're okay. You can do whatever you want with your own life, but if you ever bring Abby back here again, I will shoot you. Oh, no! Well, there's my favorite. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 Run. Come have a seat, all right? Well, I, I think that went well. Mm-hmm. Me too. <laughs> oh, that is just harsh now. She reminds me of you. So when you do get back, you and me are going to have a little chat. Make sure to say that, uh, you know, you sent some goons to go and sabotage his work. Mm, out of the spirit of honesty. God, this movie has a serious pacing issue. It never seems to escalate. It just plateaus in terms of events, you know. Like when the girl hit the... the, the when the girl hit the guitar, you'd expect something would happen, but nope, she hits the guitar and she's fine. This isn't real. But it could be. No, oh, no. What is this? We want Abby. Oh, no. Abby. A sibling for a sibling. Oh, boy. <laughs> Ah, uh, here we go again. Another security guard getting chomped up. Is there a specific reason why the the first security guard from the opening was chomped up? Does anyone know? I'm surprised that now is when he's finding their bodies. I thought their bodies were disposed of very far away or something. Oh boy, they really want the girl, man. Wait, why do they want Abby again? Like, why, apart from they get along with her, is there any other real reason? Sylvia and Jane, she fell asleep. <laughs> Those giant things getting inside. Oh, wait, this is uh, the YouTuber Cory Kenshi. This is the YouTuber Cory Kenshi. YouTubers in this film, huh? I'm assuming, I'm assuming. They put YouTubers who play this game. We've played uh, FNAF, Cory Kenshi, and Matt Pat. They tried to kill me, Vanessa. Why didn't they? They want to make her like them. Why? You know, when a character does something, it has to be crucial to like their existence, right? Like I can understand main character trying to look for the brother that he lost, but 
robot people trying to turn a normal girl into a robot person. I, I just don't understand the importance of this. It's not just their ghosts that are inside of those machines. Oh, it's some of their body parts. He influences them somehow. He took everything from them, but they don't remember. Is it the, is it the dude from Scream? Is it the dude who... Is, is it the dude who gave Mike his job or... He's my father. Oh, okay. Take these. I was like, I was like, Connie, they're not seeing him. Are you okay? Are you hurt? I don't know what's wrong with her. I don't know why she was trying to hurt me. I love you too, Mike. Oh. oh we should probably go now. Okay, come on. Enough of this pep talk in between the danger. Let's just go and then we'll have the niceties later. What's the name of this Pac-Man head character if you know comment below and smash like and subscribe if you haven't yet any any because I've never played Five Nights at Freddy's just comment below and fill me in on anything that I miss miss uh, because I've never played it The music is telling me I'm supposed to be petrified, but I'm not First I killed your brother. Oh, now I killed you. this is a uh, yellow, yellow, yellow rabbit guy. <laughs> oh, that kick. I'm not kidding, Dad. Oh, you see? So I was right. Ah, uh, it is this dude from Scream. Mm, yeah, I was very correct, at least. <laughs> you. They have not. We both know you're not gonna use a gun. Oh, oh, she's not fucking around with you. You're not really gonna kill your daughter, are you? Oh, the man is a psychopath. The man is truly a psychopath. Did she draw that just right now? I made you! I always come back. You sure she ain't dead? She got stabbed in the gut. Vanessa, I don't know if you can hear any of this not that i wanted her to die but a horror movie that can't kill main characters is not a horror movie the only people who died were like some people i met for like five minutes she's still there in pain off duty said read the Oh, come on. Uh, so many things to say about this film. Number one, I've never played Five Nights at Freddy's. I know that it's a very famous game. And uh, yeah, it's a video game series, yeah. I've never played it. So maybe if I had watched this through the lens of someone who has played the game, maybe I would have enjoyed it better. But... As a person who has only heard of the franchise, never played it. This movie was not that good. I mean, was it meant to be a scary? <laughs> because it wasn't that scary. It wasn't that scary. The only character who had like charm and great personality was the little girl. Even our main character, just sleeping and obsessing about changing something that can't be changed. And then in the end, he's like, ha. Ah, you know, what happened in the past can't be changed, so might as well appreciate what I have now. What even happened to the evil aunt? I don't even know what happened to her. As I said, a horror movie that can't kill main characters. <laughs> Not that I wanted the cop to die, but a movie that can't kill main characters isn't a horror movie. 
uh, the pacing was what really ruined this movie. I mean, at some point I looked at my clock and I was like, I was one hour into the film. Then I looked again. Then I was like, we've only watched this for... <laughs> I'm like one hour into the film, then I look, I'm one hour, five minutes to the film, I'm like, God, it feels like 20 minutes have passed by, you know. Terrible pacing, only like one character was like super interesting. Slow burn movies are okay when the character that you're following is super interesting, but no, the main character was like this beta male who can't keep a job, who sleeps all the time, who's obsessed about changing the past. And then the movie never seems to like escalate, it always seems to like plateau in terms of tension, right? Mm, especially like that part where the sister like strung the guitar you'd expect that she something would happen to her but no she gets up and she's fine guys attack the the freddy restaurant place they get wiped out and nobody comes investigating <laughs> nobody comes investigating looking for the thugs and nobody comes investigating the the break-in their bodies are hidden and then you just wipe the mess and it's like it never happened you know out of 10 i give that movie a four Maybe if I was a fan of FNAF, I would have enjoyed it more. But if you are familiar with the video game series, you can comment below, smash like and subscribe, tell me what you thought of this movie. This wasn't a scary movie, honestly. I don't know if it was meant to be horror, but it definitely was not scary. But on the screen, I'll leave other reactions I've done for scary movies. This year, I've done a lot of them. Tell me what you thought of this film and fill me in on anything that... You know, maybe it would have made me, my experience with the movie better than I'll see in the next one.